Steve here with Table Rock Tea Company. This is a follow-up video to one I did a few weeks ago about making cuttings off of this very special plant. So if you don't recall, this is a very, very unique and interesting Camellia sinensis tea plant. Um, it is one of anomaly uh, of about one in 12,000, something like that, that has these very, very small leaves. Uh, the trunk, though, is very much asamica, and then the leaf structure is very much sinensis. It makes a really interesting ornamental, and we've had several horticultural people here that are absolutely just um, intrigued and stunned by this plant, including some from China. So I'm going to take you over here to show you how the cuttings are going along. Pardon the uh, wobbly camera. I still don't have my gimbal yet, but... Hopefully I'll get that pretty soon. Um, but as I had said in the previous video, uh, I made cuttings. Usually we make cuttings around the 4th of July. Hey, Jazzy. And uh, that's when things are warm enough for long enough that you can get them established. But I, uh, yeah, truthfully, I forgot. I got busy on the farm. And that's just how farm life is. And so I forgot to make cuttings until a couple of weeks ago. And these are the cuttings right now. But... When you look through, first of all, all of these guys are still alive, okay? So none of the leaves are browning, and I'm really happy about that because um, we uh, don't have these covered. Uh, normally, I would put these in something like that, you know, a germination bin uh, where you can see where all the humidity stays in. And I didn't do that with these. I just didn't have... Um, the stuff to do it with and so took a chance made a bunch of cuttings and they're all uh, seemingly alive but here's what i wanted to show you when you make the when you cut the right spot um right above that little node now you can see these little guys brand new nodes are coming out and uh, that's a really good sign so they're in a bunch of them in fact um, let me see i'll just kind of keep scanning through but you can see, yeah, all these are developing uh, new shoots. So I think it's quite possible that we're going to get all of these are pretty close too. So that's uh, that's pretty good. I'm happy about that. Again, just trying to preserve this very rare plant. So um, we call this uh, this particular one Ebby Tea in honor of the people that sold us the land. Um, and so we'll plant a little grove of that as well. I might be working with a local horticulturalist to see about actually uh, replicating that and, and naming it and being all official and everything like that. So we'll see. But I just wanted to show you how the cuttings are coming along, even though it's late in the season. So thanks for watching. Stay tuned to see what else is brewing here at Table Rock Tea Company.